So we're taking over this workshop so I can go over on explaining how to make the turrets work. Apparently this is a problem from day one, and a friend of mine told me about that. And when he said that, it got me thinking, like, if this is a problem that's been going on since day one, maybe it's not really then a problem that they need to fix. Maybe there's something that we're supposed to do to make the turrets work better. So that's what we're going to go over. All right, does that sound good? Excellent. I'm also going to go over some other things on what I do with my workshop. I got this idea from another friend. Uh, she's pretty cool. And uh, to have a blueprint of what you want to do with your workshop rather than trying to place your weapons and stuff. Um, to kind of have a little blueprint ahead of time. And you can make it however you want. And doing this is also how I was able to test on how to get the turrets working so I'm gonna be going over that I also may repeat myself a few times because on how I'm recording it I'm recording this all in one go and then later I'll go and I'll edit it and every once in a while I'll edit out something I said and I'll not realize it you know it's it happens right so the cool thing about doing this blueprint is I want heavy guns and another tip I want to put out there for those that want to put the big heavy turrets, you have the plans for it automatically. But you have to have your perk card set up right. So for what I got going on, it says level 3 home defense. You got to have at least that. Um, anytime you need to know, you just look on the right side as you're building it and it'll tell you. I also like putting a generator on top. This way I can power up whatever it is I want to power up, not just my weapons, but also keeping it up higher keeps it away from the NPCs. And I've wired this a few different ways. You can wire it however you want. So this is the key on how to get your turrets to work. Feel free to try this out yourself. I hope you would try this out yourself, you know? These are targeting lights. I find that interesting because they track the enemy. I'm like, well, if they track the enemy for what person? Just puts a light on it, okay. But I wondered if, if I put these lights on, if it would actually help the turret. And for me, it helps so give it a try that's the big secret you got to put those lights on it I've been doing that for a while look already boom surprise I got a little added like I said I forget to anyways the other big tip I wanted to put in here was, as you can see on the right side of the screen, that all the, the circuits, the gears, the glass, the oil, the screws, the steel, all that is green. That means it's coming from the workshop pool. It's not costing you anything. So anytime you have a workshop and, God forbid, you get one of those fucking P versus P fuckers, you know, might even be me. Hey, and they're like, oh, I destroyed your shit and cost you. No, you don't cost me anything. They don't cost you anything as long as that's green. It goes in the pool, doesn't cost you anything. If you see it white, well, then it's costing you your actual supplies. But as long as it's green, it's not costing you anything. So I thought I'd put that in real quick. All right, let's continue. Your regular scavenger. Let's continue your regular... See, it's a, it's a kill joke. You know what? The joke's dead. I'm beating a dead horse. We're moving on. Fuck that. And you can set them up, you know, pretty sure however you want. I'm testing this thing out. I, I've just noticed that a few times I put more lights out, they work. And then I thought, well, what if I put these uh, targeting lights out? And uh, how well does that help? And I see a big improvement. So that's the big kicker. I 
And as you can see, I'm doing a, d a defense because when you take over a workshop, you got to defend it. And as you see with just a few lights, my turrets are already actively shooting and I'm not involved in the in the battle. I think that's pretty cool. I also like the rockets because the rockets shoot further. Alright, let's pull out the heavy guns. See? And that's just with a couple heavy duty rocket launchers on there. So, to answer that, yep, the rockets do more damage. And a little more tip the Enclave ones are, I want to say, roughly twice as strong as the regular ones. I mean, you can set this up in here however you want. I usually just do, you know, a couple workbenches, stash box, you know, the, the, the usual stuff. And the reason why I chose this workshop was just so I could have room to build my new ideas and blueprint it. So now that I got this set up the way I want, I'm going to blueprint it. And I'm going to step inside of it just to make sure that I can select everything. So I'll be pounding the right bump just to make sure. But see how it's all blued out and grayed out and all that good stuff. So now I'm going to name it. I try to name it something simple, you know. But see, this is why I blueprint, so that you can put little things out like this. Got to do the plug-in, right? So for this next part, I'm going to quickly build a generator so that when I go to set it up, I can set it up pretty quick because you usually have to defend your workshop once you take it over. And at the same time, God forbid, this is a good time to get P versus P. So I want to get this part done quickly as possible so I can be ready for this P versus P. And this time, since I'm being creative, I get bored. I like to build stuff. I put some lights in it just to give it that effect that, you know, it's a generator that's got all kinds of lights and gadgets and bells and whistles and all that good stuff. And once again, I'm going to blueprint it. So as you can see, I have this all set up now name it whatever you want i can do my generator real quick i got my workshop that i can do real quick with the equipment that i'm going to need to use and now you know how to do the turrets try the spotlight try any lights try both see the difference it makes and this should make your life a whole lot easier hope this was helpful as always like and subscribe and i will see you guys on the next one